I'm Joe Thompson, uh, technician here at the Bio and Ag Engineering Department. This is our uh, farm scale biodiesel production facility. And what we're looking at here is our oil seed press. Uh, but this, this is a, uh, an oil expeller press and it's, it's, it was made in Japan. It was, it's a sea cocoa and we've had it since the early 80s. This is how we get our feedstock. We take seed from the U of I farm. We get it from local growers. It's a great little press. It'll do about 100 pounds of seed an hour. Out of that 100 pounds, depending on the, the oil content of the seed, you get possibly you know, four to five gallons of oil out. If it's something like canola or rapeseed or even mustard. The way it's set up, we can dump like a ton of seed up in that bin up there and we have two presses that are both fed by that bin. This particular one has an auger. It's, it's an auger fed and it's also, it's automated. It's got this uh, photo cell here that keeps this hopper full. The nice thing about this setup is that you can see the seed actually going into the press. So it's great for a visual thing. And the auger is surrounded by cage bars and then the, the seed is forced up against these cage bars by this auger and the remaining part of the seed goes through this slot here that's adjustable between this ring and this tapered end of the shaft. The oil seeps down and goes through the cage bars. We have it so that the oil flows into a kind of a primary settling tank and then it flows, it overflows into a second tank which gets periodically pumped out into larger settling tanks. That oil, after it's settled for a week, possibly, it's very clean. It can be pumped right into the reactor to make biodiesel. It doesn't really even need to be filtered at that point. The meal is augered into this bin. We either, you know, bag it or send it to the, uh, up to the farm where they, they do some feeding trials with it. We've been using these since the early 80s and they're they're very, very good presses. They, they hold up well. They're pretty easy to work on. At times we've done 10 ton a year. Other times, maybe one or two. It just depends on what's needed and who needs meal, who needs oil, and how much seeds available. So there you have it. Uh, this is our oil seed press, which is an essential part of a biodiesel production facility here at the U of I.